So my name is Nermin Mohammed and I work at an AT&T CU in Ericsson and this is a virtual home gateway uh, demo and by virtual home gateway demo we means that we have a personalized service for certain user and as this user move from home into mobile network or operator network it takes its service policy and configuration with it. So now I'm going to show you this uh, proof of concept. First we have different type of devices as you see here we have medical devices, we have media devices, and we have mobile uh, devices. And each type of devices have different requirements. Some of them have different requirements on security, throughput, or latency, and we have different configuration and policy assigned for each user. And then as this user moves across different network, it moves across different gateway depending on which network or access technology it's used. So here we're having Wi-Fi gateway which you may be used in office or maybe in a Starbucks or McDonald's place. And then we have BNG if you're connected to wireline network and EPG if you're connecting to LTE. And in here we're showing several applications that the user can access. Some of them are virtualized network function BNFs and some are physical nodes or physical application. And there is uh, SDN aware switches which is based on OFS, open flow switch or evolved flow switch EFS. And then we have the SDN controller. The SDN controller provides the separation between the control plane and data plane which allow to dynamically provision the network and also for programmability of the network. And on top of that we have PPSC, this is broadband service chaining or service controller which control the flows and the flows will get be deployed by SDN controller and then we have the policy controller. So let's assume this demo we have a family and this is a self-service portal for this family which shows the current plan, its basic plan and this self-service portal is used by the family head in order to set the policy and configuration per user in this family. So this one shows the utilization of each device and then this is the application store which we can order an application and buy it immediately and it get deployed in the network in real time. And then if we go down here then we'll find the family member. We assume here we have family of three people. Zalt is an adult, Wasim is a teenager, and Sham is a kid. And based on this, each one, it has different configuration and different policy. Like if I look at Zalt, Zalt can enable video accelerator in order to have higher throughput when downloading video. And it, he can have like a turbo post which have a higher throughput for 10 minutes for all applications. And that's for Zolt. If I go to Wasim, Wasim is a teenager. So if I go down there to see his policy, he has a parental control in his service chaining. So he has a plug sources and he has time restricted sources as well. Okay, so let's maybe go up there and show how the user as moves across different network takes its policy with him. So let's assume we have Zolt. Zolt right now in his office. If I open the map, it shows Zolt in his office. And he goes here through Wi-Fi gateway and then goes through firewall, CGNet, and goes out to the public internet. And let's assume that, that Zolt moves from his office into anywhere. And then he moves from the Wi-Fi gateway into EPG. And as he moves into EPG, he still keeps his policy with him and his same service chaining. And then let's assume that he moves back into his home, then he goes through BNG keeping up his policy. If I click on Sham or Wasim, sorry, he goes into another service chain which is customized for that user.